All right then. Hello. Let's just uh, jump straight back in with the next episode. Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, I know that is a completely different intro to what I normally do, but after listening back and my friends listening back, I realised just how cringy I sound being like, hey guys, welcome back. This is another Let's Play. Here we go. So it is a little bit cringy, but we've got to go find a different crawl and a giant purple toad. So that is the intro. Uh, obviously, if you guys do come across this video, be sure to drop a like. Of course, that is always very much appreciated. We hit three likes, which is just yet another achievement for me. So, aha, uh -huh. that is where we need to go. Let's go for Bidden Forest and then fast, then fly. So yeah, I don't want to be too cringy with my intros. Uh, there might be a way that I can do it, but. I may just do like a welcome guys and all that stuff like that, but Oh I forget it's snowy season. Oh look at Hogwarts, we gotta fly no we'll do it, we'll do that at some point, we'll fly over Hogwarts. Look at it. It looks so good. I can't get over it. I love the snow theme. Oh man, I'm very excited. Right, let's go for a, quite a giant purple toad with a knapsack. Then we've got to go find a Duracool with a knapsack. And once we've done those two, we should be able to learn a Bombarder. Oh, man, it's nice to be on this game. This will be the only episode of today, just to clarify. Uh, as I'm extremely tired and... Okay, I start work at 6 in the morning. So... Uh, that is nothing to look forward to. I guess I'll show you guys what it what to do when popping these balloons. It's as simple as pop, 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 pop and pow. Did the experience pop three or five balloons? Right, giant purple toads. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Oh, that's... Sorry, Purple Toad. There we go, you're free. We got a giant Purple Toad. Which will be 10. And we found it next to a random water thing. We've got to get a Diracruel. Is there a Diracruel area around here? We've just got to look for beasts. Diracruel? Puffskin, Niffla, Puffskin, I can't believe I actually found, what, well I found Giant Purple Toad, I found a Giant Purple Toad straight away, where could Dura, Mooncalf, Unicorn, uh, no Dura Cruel though, where could, where should I look for, Beast stuff. But the. Where are they? Uh, Duracool? Whooper? Things I don't need typically enough. Duracool? Chubba Knuckle? Um. Uh, one there. Niffler, for God's sakes, it's not going to happen, is it? Game. Fuiper, so it's everything but what I need, pretty much. That's great. Cheers, game. Where am I meant to find? <laughs> so long. So where can I find, I might have to just Google this, just make my life a little bit easier. Um, that doesn't seem to be anything anywhere. Could I fly about? I could, but let's find a Duracool den. Uh, I'll keep talking to you guys while I'm at it, but for now... Uh, 
Derek Cool Dan. Make sure the volume's turned down on my phone. Let's see where I can find a Derek Cool Dan. Uh, let me just figure out where this actually is. It looks like it's. Hmm. I felt like I'd be able to find this, but. I don't know where that is, boss. Moon car. This guy hasn't helped me at all. He hasn't given me any notification as to where. Let's see if this guy can help me. I don't know where to go. So he's gonna let me just go from the sorry, this is taking so long. I do apologize, but I need to figure out this with this because I will never find it. So if we go all the way out, Hogwarts Valley, and it's by the jagged point, so like here, let's go there, how far is that, 1300, let's fast travel, god I'm actually having to google this, I'm so sorry people, I'm so sorry but the game's the game, the game's the game, and I don't care. Sorry, I just moved the mic to my mouth for loud purposes. Uh, I have had a couple. Just, just so you guys are aware, I've had a couple of pints, so I might be a. Oh, I'm not waved, but I'm definitely feeling the alcohol juice inside of me. Is there a? This could be it. This is going to be it right here. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Where is a... That's a Diracool. There it is! Oh. Hey, Diracool. Give me you. One. Two. Three. My god, it's teleported. We got the Diracle. Assignment's all finished. Well, we're at it. 30 experience. Let's see if this thing can... There's a lot of enemies here. I think we'll leave it. But we got the Diracle. Let's go learn Bombarda. Uh, where am I going to go? I got to go... I guess astronomy tower. I don't think it's going to be the astronomy tower, but we'll see. Very well, could be. I may, I may be completely wrong, but and I am very clearly completely wrong. Right, uh, where do I go here? Uh, oh. Looks like it's outside. To tell you the truth. Let's go there. Hogwarts North exit. Maybe. I don't know where to go. Oh, it's beast class. Right, so. Didn't ask to teleport there. But we move. Let's go to beast. If I'd done it, it was just a 10 beast class. To be fair, I, I missed when it. Whoa. I've got kites flying around. Look how snowy it is. It looks so good at all times. Stop it, game. You're just mesmerizing me every second we play. It's so cute. Look at it. I want him. I want him in real life. That's a niffler. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. 
My oh. brother's doing well, thank I take it you're ready to learn your new spell. Everyone just speaking over each other for some reason, but yes, I am ready. I completed your assignment, Professor. I'm ready to learn Bombarda now. Good. Now, this spell comes with a caveat. It should only be used when necessary. The exploding charm, as you might suspect, can hurt people. Use caution when casting it. No. Of course, Professor. I will, Professor. I will hold you to that promise. Now, you must be precise in your wand movements. We don't want you blowing your hand off. Go ahead. They talk about not using risky spells in Hogwarts, but this is clearly a risky spell. Remember, the exploding charm is highly volatile. I'm looking forward to this spell. Bombarder. You've seen Ginny Weasley use it in actual Harry Potter. Fifth movie to clarify, but I don't know. She, I can't recall if she used it any time else. Bombarder. Well now, let us put it into practice, shall we? Go ahead and try it on the pumpkins. It's not Halloween anymore. Uh, five or six assignments. Professor Howen's assignment. We need one more spell to learn. We need one more assignment. But we have unlocked Bombarda. There was heavy damage on impact accompanied by an explosion that can destroy heavy obstacles and hit surrounding enemies. Hmm. I don't really need that twice, do I? Yeah, that works for me. Let's try one more. 150 experience. There's brilliant charm bombard. It's a heavy damage spell that causes an explosive blast on our barrier. Excellent wand work. Cast the spell just like that every time. Assured and in control. Nice and simple, I suppose. There's a lot of explosions for bombard, aren't there? You have it well in hand. It's very good. Level 2 lot. I've got to get level 2 Alahamora and I really just don't want to. Alright, what did... In the Shadow of the Undercroft... Sebastian sent me an owl saying he found something interesting in the book from the Scriptorium and he wants to learn... He wants to discuss it in the Undercroft. We will do that next. Let's go to the Undercroft. Astronomy Wing. Uh, let's go Defense Against the Dark Arts Classroom. It's not a tower, I don't think. Ah, simple loading screens. Takes about two seconds to load the game. We haven't seen Defense of the Dark Arts or anything like that in a very long time. I thought there'd be more classes. I wish there was more classes, but I guess the game's got to run at its pace, to be fair. Nope, no one's helping you. Goodbye, boss. Let's go to the Undercroft and speak with Sebastian. I hope everything's clear with my voice. I don't want my mic to be too close to my mouth, but at the same time I'm trying to make sure it's not too far away from my mouth. So let's hope to God that everything's all good. Hello, Sebastian. You'll never believe what I What did you discover in the spellbook we found in the scriptorium? Salazar Slytherin's spellbook was a little difficult to interpret, but fascinating. Evidently, he encouraged teaching dark magic at Hogwarts. Neither the Imperious Curse nor the Killing Curse was unforgivable during his time. He believed students should be prepared to use dark magic when necessary, not to fear it. That's why we had to use Crucio to gain access to the Scriptorium. He didn't want his knowledge shared with anyone who was afraid of the power of dark magic. I agree. We did what we had to do. It was hard to do, but casting Crucio was our only option. And I'm glad we did it, because in the spellbook I also found something else. References to a lost relic, which, from what I can tell, Grants the holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. And you think this relic might be able to save Anne? Precisely. I plan to search for this relic, but I don't think we should tell anyone. Especially Ominous. He wouldn't understand. I won't say a word. I see no reason to involve Ominous. I'm glad you agree. When I know more, I shall send an owl. Well, as simple as that. Simple conversation, I suppose. Sorry for Ominous. Keeping this to ourselves for now is for his own good. I'll decide what's for my own good. Ominous. Uh oh. We were just about to get some air. Care to join? You're a liar, Sebastian. I heard everything. You swore you'd never engage in anything to do with dark magic again. 
No, I didn't. I said I understood you wanting that. I'd never swear to give up on finding a cure for Anne. You don't know when to stop, do you? I know when not to stop. Leave this alone, Ominous. I'll be on my way. <laughs> but a spark him out there, I swear to God. I am not letting this go. Ominous, Sebastian Manuel. I know what I heard. You knew I wouldn't agree with this. Going after that relic is not a good idea. Sebastian doesn't even realize it, but he's as irresponsible and reckless now as his parents were years ago. It's why they died. What happened to Sebastian's parents? I knew his parents died, but I never heard what happened. Mr. and Mrs. Sallow were professors, spent nearly every waking moment in the cellar library. Nose is buried in books. Anne and Sebastian were upstairs when it happened. They heard a sudden crash and ran downstairs, but it was too late. Their parents had crumpled to the floor. A defect with the lamp in the cellar caused the room to fill with an undetectable toxin. Sebastian and Anne were helpless. They had no magic yet. What a horrible story. It is. That's why I can't understand Sebastian's recklessness. I've practically lost Anne. I cannot lose Sebastian too. Please avoid anything to do with that spell book. The spell book is giving Sebastian hope. Those references in the book seem promising. Everything to do with Salazar Slytherin seems promising until it's too late. I hope Sebastian pursues this no further. But if you think he might, please let me know. I actually feel bad for him. I actually feel so bad for him. Simple conversation there. We haven't been going for very long at all. Let's go talk to Deke in the room of requirement. We're just making some side quest attempts. Luckily, these are quite small missions, so hopefully this one's quite a small mission as well. Um, because we're just making some dents. We've learned a new spell. Deke has an idea to share with you. Let's go talk to Deke. Hello, Deke. You want to talk to me? Hello, Deke. You wanted to talk to me. Indeed. Uh, Deke thought you might want to learn how to build a breeding pen so that you can breed beasts. Uh, I would like that. That sounds like a very good idea. Rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. Uh, young beasts are particularly vulnerable to poachers. Breeding beasts here in the room will allow us to keep the younger ones safe. I see. What do I need to do? First, bring a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Indeed suggests rescuing Thestrals, as they're at great risk from poachers. Noble creatures, but their relationship with death gives them a bad reputation. They're prized by poachers for their tail hairs. I've seen Thestrals before, but where would I find a pair of them nearby? Deke has seen some wild Thestrals not too far from the Hogwarts grounds. Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the pen from Tomes and Scrolls and gather the materials it requires. Once you've rescued the Thestrals and you have the spellcraft, you come and find Deke. Oh, the dead. Let's go a male festival and purchase a breeding pen spellcraft. Let's see if I can find first the the male festival. I'm assuming it's right. So we've only got a female festival. Let's go to the over there and get a. Uh, male? Festral? I have no idea how to tell if it's a male or a female, that's the issue. Oh, bye bye, I'm off, see you in a bit. Whoop! Whoop! I should investigate. Whoa, why has everything gone green? Whoa, Oh, I'm over a bandit camp thing, that's why. Oh, there we go. So we need... Oh. Okay, we need to do this. Excuse me. Fuck. 
Do cooperate, won't you? I need a... No, I want a wing guard in Leviosa. Oh, crap. Oh, man. Maybe I can find a sleeping one. I'm just dancing around trees right now. Vestrals aren't having it, are they? Could I not have like a sleeping Festral? Are oh, the Festral actually just left? Like straight up? Revelio. Is there not a Festral nearby now? Have I lost all the Festrals? Oh crap. Quick. Quicker. Get up! Please be a male. Is that not a male? How are you meant to know if it's a male or a female? Is it just random? I'm pretty sure it's just going to be random. That one is sat down. That is so prime. Okay, he's no longer sat down. Come on. Faster. Please just be male. Got it. The experience level up. Nope. But we've got on the mail, which is the main thing. We got on the mail. So let's go back to Hogsmeade and get a. Was it a, a spellcraft? What do you have to get? It seems all <gasps> lead to Hogsmeade. Oh no way, this looks nuts. Winter Hogsmeade looks so good. It looks so good, I love it. I love this game. I love this game, it's so good. Oh man, it's so much fun. Nice to see a familiar face. Hello, Thomas Brown. What do I have to get? That breeding pen spellcraft. A spellcraft to conjure a breeding pen to breed beasts in the old vivarium. Now we can conjure a breeding pen in the room. Best let's get rid of, deep let's get rid of these green shits. For now, green, green. Oh, I just got rid of something that was better. Whatever, I don't give a fuck. Worse. Same. Worse. Keep that just in case. Worse. Keep that just in case. Worse. Worse. That'll do for now. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. Cheers, mate. Um, let's get a map. And let's go talk back with Deke and see what. Deke is saying, let's go to the room of requirement. We haven't been to the map chain. We don't, we don't go to the map chain very often. There's a lot of side missions in here, though. Especially with good old Deaky door, Deaky boy. Interact. Uh, I've rescued the Thestrals and bought the spellcraft for the pen. I've rescued the Thestrals and bought the spellcraft for the pen. Excellent. Now, to breed your Thestrals, simply release them into the same vivarium in which you conjure the pen. Then use the pen to start the process. Come and see Deke when you're finished. I shall. I wonder where I should conjure their pen. <laughs> he says that, like, talking to himself, but oh, another upgrade. Swamp. This isn't Shrek. Deke never grows tired of the room surprises. We now have the perfect place for those Thestrals. Please let Deke know once you've bred them. Conjure a breeding pen. Oh my god, that is bright. Right, so we've got to do this. 
And we've got to do a breeding pen. Beast items. Breeding pen. So now what do I do? I guess we go to the bag. We go back over here. Oh. Oh, hello. I'm assuming you interact with that. But these bees into the water to breed them. Bees can be rescued in the highlands. Jumping with toads. So if we do... Oh, I'll just say they're genders. If we do that, and that. And there we go. Have I got to feed them? Brush. And then we go to here and feed. Okay, didn't mean to do that. I don't care at this point. Are they female? Get a little bit of love, both of you. Bestral hair. Bestral hair. What's going on? What do I do here? Special to breed. Oh, I see. I've got to wait. I've got to wait that long. I've got to wait 29 minutes. Well, that's that then, I suppose. I didn't realize you had to wait 29 minutes to do something like that. It was fairly simple, but I guess we will complete that in the next episode. So next we have, what do we have next? We have the main mission, baby. We have meeting Poppy. Poppy is waiting in the area in the, to the far north of Hogwarts as the broom flies. I think it is fair to say that is what we're going to call it. I'm sorry for being a bit of a short episode, but due to me, uh, well, due to me, the hair, uh, festival hair, the hair is shared by the winged and skeletal vegetables. I was saying swampy areas, festival hair can be used to upgrade in this home trails, trace the gear. Yeah, producing me waking up at six in the morning, I'm already extremely tired. So I hope you guys can understand that it's a bit of a shorter episode, but tomorrow I'll be back to give you guys uh, more content and we will continue with the main mission. So if you guys have enjoyed, be sure to drop a like, it's always appreciated, and I will catch you guys in the next episode where we will continue to make dents in the story and breed festivals, right?